Legion. A mountain to climb. They are just not finding anything here. Eventually, TJ will find one. A little bit of split spawns. He'll try and stay alive towards Back Kitchen to give his team the opportunity to break through the front door. TJ finds a second. Octane will eventually get him. They know the spawns are pushing them as well. But Legion needs some kills. Surreal finds a way through. Into bottom glass. Will get dealt with though. It's just looking far too easy. Honestly, the Vegas Legion it looks like it's very one by one by one. Good kills coming in from Temp though. Gets that kitchen control. The rest of the team not quite here. Draws at the last remaining member of Thieves on this point with 20 seconds to go. He will get dealt with. Vegas Legion looking to clean up this final 15 seconds in the first rotation of Hills. But the bad news for you, 206 points for the side of Thieves. 200 point mark, a broken one rotation of Hills. Quite simply flawless from Thieves. Poor from Legion. They're gonna need to step up in this second rotation of Hills. To real, trying to do everything he can to stay alive. Oh. Place to win the gunfight, but only just. Eventually a bit of shooting going through as well. Legion starting to get some points back onto the board. We've seen comebacks at this tournament already. Do they have it in them to find another? I mean, they've kind of kept that 100 point cap quite some time, so I suppose that's something you can cling on to, but you need to start closing that gap relatively quickly. Thieves can play scrap time the rest of this game and win it quite comfortably, but this is a good start to the second rotation here from Legion. A lot more resolute, the pushes are coming from Thieves, but have they taken their foot off the gas? They need to make sure they're locking in for P2 coming up. It could be a big money maker for one of these two teams. Well, here we go. Could be the last ride of the Legion on this map. They got the time on P1. They stopped the bleed. They broke the go. 100 points. P2 is calling. Destiny is calling as well. And they are finding it done. They have got into P2 last time around. This was broken in seconds. It cannot happen again. A small glimmer of hope for the side of Vegas Legion. Looking over towards the dual side though, that's where the push is coming in from Thieves. There's a big gunfight going to go on over towards the bar. In just a second as well, Clay Sekou with his pants down. But the kills on the other side of things work out for Vegas Legion. Pinch set up here for Thieves. They're looking for it, they're trying to get into is fighting every single angle they can. The trades come through. The Legion are out, Clay Sekou will find one to try and stop them coming as well. But you can see the Legion one desperately back into this. Oh. Every single point that goes against them is a oh. dagger to the heart, but Clay does not missing. Not a great start, but he's playing better now. Can't find that final kill. Tempest there to try and clean it up. The kills come through, though, for the side of Thieves. And this is the problem for Vegas Legion. They are so far behind. They need to fight for every single second that is on offer. Too real into the point. Envoy will be the first to fall. Kenny is there to follow him, potentially. They need these points. These need these kills. They also need the rotation, which is now going in. Vegas Legion are there. The final moments of Scrap will go over towards them as well. It's all about these fights in restaurant now. And here we go. LA Thieves ready to pitch. Two real front of the At the same time, he found Kenny. Reinforcements flooding for the Legion. Already one player is going to go down. The rest of them are stuck inside the kitchen. Hoping for it. Octane towards the back of the pitch. Place to find one. He knows where Octane is as well. The gunning is coming through. Done. The Legion are starting to believe that this is possible. It is plausible. They are holding the Thieves at bay. They're holding them at bay, but it's still a 70 point gap. They've got to close down. But that time is ticking towards Legion. Kleister goes on a huge spree. Back for dead. Vegas Legion, you're very right. They're starting to believe, but have they heated up just a little bit too late? These rotations need to be flawless. The holes need to be brilliant. They need Thieves to collapse to come back into oh! this game. But Kleister. This man's nearly 31 years old. He's absolutely frying on the main stage now. It is going to be a 30 point game by the time we get over towards the next hill. The Legion are not here. The Thieves are. One last chance for the Legion. They need a break. They need a break now. TJ Gunn's the first. The rest are reinforcing. The time is ticking. They have brought this back to a hair's breadth. And they are moving mad, every single kill they need, they are finding the Legion of fighting back, they are not done, they will not go quietly into the night, as they start to get towards the 200 point limit, the Thieves are being rebuffed, they are being beaten back on every single gunfight, what can they do? Thieves can get nowhere near this, and this is when things start to get a little bit funny. <laughs> Thieves now in the descendancy, if anything. It's all absolute craziness across the map. Oh my goodness, what is going on? Hold your breath. Vegas Legion take the lead as 
we head into the next hill, but it's a small break from Thieves. Leeds are not here at restaurant. It is a seven point game as we head over towards the next hill. 19 tournament for Clayster and he's trying to put every bit of veterancy into this comeback that he can. Two real finds to kill. The Thieves are in kitchen. It's reinforcements for Legion. Here come the Thieves. They cannot allow this to slip now. And there is snaking going on. Octane and Envoy have broken through. Ten five. Finds the second 1v1. And it's Clayster looking for the last. And he's got it at <laughs> Ten seconds, ten points. The comeback of the CDL year. Can they do it? The thieves are moving, but they are moving into the kill scene. And Legion has just made the greatest comeback in half point you will ever see. History has just been made. The Legion would not let it go. We've seen teams give up at that point. We were questioning whether or not they would even break the 100 point mark. But they took it. They roared past. 200 was next. The rotations arrived. And Clayster and the rest of Vegas decided we will not be having more malarkey today. That <laughs> is a breakdown. If I've ever seen one. The Vegas Legion. What? TJ was like 0 and 26. I I don't know what to tell you. And, and that's the kind of game you are delusionally confident if you are thieves because you are frying them. It is not even close to being a competitive game. And then when they start calling it back, you're like, okay, let's switch on. Then it gets to 70 points. You're like, okay, right, they've got kitchen rotation. Let's show, make sure we rotate. They do, but Vegas Legion find the break, and then they find the break, and then they find the rotation, they find a hold, they find a map one win, and pull it out of the depths of, I, I, I don't even know what to say. That is a ridiculous comeback. I'd love to know the stats in terms of how it broke down of the final five hills, because it feels like Legion got every point in Thieves got absolutely nothing. This may be an optic home crowd, but everybody's heart and blood was singing for Vegas in those moments. Look how far behind they were. Look how badly it was going for them. When we talk about ice, we talk about veteran C. 206 to 63 ton. 206 to 63, let's do the maps. Maybe a little bit better than Ghosty. <laughs> what? So what's that turnaround? They would have got 33, so that would have brought them to... Uh, that's like... They basically did to them what got done to them that first rotation of hills. They just did it straight back to Thieves. And where is your mental if you're the LA Thieves now? Rotation after rotation, you only need scrap time if you're above the 200 point mark with 140 points to spare. And you find 30 for the rest of the game. That's pretty bad. For the, for the Thieves, that is gonna be disappointing. The Legion turned on the burners, a 1.63 from Temp. And they started off, basically everybody negative. <laughs> I'm actually still perplexed. I can't believe that just happened. We have a saying when we do our cast and stuff, when we talk about teams, about selling the dream, right? It's one of the core tenets of what we do here at the CDL. Over and over again, we sell the dream. We make you believe it is possible, even if we don't think it is. <laughs> I didn't think that and was possible. And we were selling the dream. <laughs> and Vegas lived it. Man, I mean, if you were selling the dream, you're the best Potentially salesman. do I... something here as he finds one under Kenny. All they need is two seconds. Too real, two seconds. Draws a must hold against his players. They play against his players. They will find two. And that's going to be it. It's done. It's over. It's driven into the history books. Come up the hour. Come up the legion. They take down the Titans of Thieves. And magic always happens at the majors. A disaster class from Thieves. Maps 1 and 2 will haunt them for a long, long time.
No questions about three and four though. Wonderful performance from Legion who put their foots on the throat of Thieves from the word go and did not let up. Brilliant performance on Mikado. It's really been their standout when it comes down to the half point. And they show it there once again. Huge performance from Clayster. Big statement from Legion. They have an opportunity in this loser's bracket now. 90 tournaments and not a gunny lost, not a percent, not an inch of skill removed from that man's repertoire. And we have seen Titans already fall. The subliners are gone from this tournament and now the thieves join them. Competition is very much alive in the CDL. And my goodness, do I love land. Oh, I didn't think you weren't going to be here. Oh, Nelly. <laughs> Thank God. What a game that was. Legion clutch up in maps one and two, which ultimately does give them the victory. Yeah, control sucks, but who cares? <laughs> really good game from them. 250 to 229. And that will give them so much confidence heading into the rest of the tournament. We're still all early doors, of course. That's two wins on the day. Kleister's getting hyped up. Vegas Legion are going to be a problem. They are. They have every reason to be hyped. The biggest comeback in Hardpoint this year. A 6-5 on the s &D. There was a control, but we'll ignore that for now. And 250 to 229. The plays and the MVP of that map number four, by the way, was probably too real. Over and over again, he's done it. And whew, I'm glad to be here. I know, I need to lie down now. My goodness, I mean, that is a humongous win for the Vegas Legion uh, production just in my ear there. Is that the biggest win in their history? I think it may well be, to be honest with you. Big moment on the big stage against a big team in a comeback that we will probably never see the likes of for quite some time. Let's go to Ali on the stage. I, I hope it's replaced. I don't care who it is. The Vegas Legion take the game. They do indeed, Ton. A massive, massive W here for Temp and the Las Vegas Legion. Texas, get loud for these guys. Oh, we got the smoke, too? High quality, man. High quality. No, Temp, I got to ask you, man. I know the casters were talking about it. You have been with this franchise for such a long time. Seeing a W like that, how does it make you feel? Feels amazing. Um, words can't describe it. Our practice has been a little, you know, turbulent, a little shaky. You know, we didn't win a map the other day, and then we came out and, you know, we're, we're on a roll right now, so we just got to keep this momentum. Dude, I got to take you back to the hard point, right? I, was, I had to write it down. 206 to 63. What does that say about the team that you guys did not fold? You managed to make one of the craziest comebacks we've seen in hard point in a long time. So when you're in those situations, you just got to slow it down and get a kill. It's very, very simple. Um, we knew we weren't making like any drastic mistakes. We just got to slow it down and get a kill. And we kept belief the whole time. And hey, we turned it around. That's what happens when you keep belief. Absolutely, man. It feels like that has really been the, the story with the Legion franchise so far throughout this season. Another spot that I got to take you to. Search and Destroy goes to around 11. It ends up being you versus Kenny in a 1v1. Yeah. What's the mentality like in a spot like that? Yeah, I didn't even know it was Kenny, but uh, after I won it, T was like, yo, it was Ken. I knew you had that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's my duo. Shout out, shout out to Ken. You know what I'm saying? But uh, so I got terrible timing. I chowed out the door trying to make like an aggressive winner play, just go right. rogue and chow. And as soon as I went through the door, he went through the door and shot Clay. So it was kind of just a scramble. And I came out on top, man. You did indeed. You did indeed. And the crazy part, too, is that, you know, we're looking at this series. We're watching, okay, Thieves, are they going to answer back? They come out, win the control. But again, you guys don't fold. You answer back in the Mercado. It feels like the hard point's in a better spot. In general, man, just kind of give us a, a feel for what the camp feels like right now. What's the mentality like right now for Legion? Uh, we've, we're feeling a lot better. Like I said, we have some very off days, and a lot of our problems from our past roster are still prevalent. So we're doing our best to, to fix them. Uh, we're watching so much VOD, we're doing so much research, we're grinding, so we just gotta keep working and we gotta make a run this tournament, get some points. Well, I gotta ask you, what's gonna be the thing that gets you guys as far as you really wanna be? If there's one situation, one map, one mode, mentality, whatever it is, what's gonna get you guys far in this tournament? I would say control. I feel like the top teams are very, very good at control and we're not great at control right now. So I feel like in a series where we steal the control and we beat Thieves last time in control, that sealed the deal on the series. So if we can win a control, 
anything is possible. We just got to win a control. I love that. KG, anything is possible. Love that mentality. Anything you want to say to the Legion fans, the Texas fans that are out here for the you guys? The crowd's been amazing. Keep going crazy for every team, not just our team. You know what I'm saying? I hope y'all have a great time. We're going to continue to put on the show. And I love all y'all, man. Enjoy y'all night. Absolutely. That is Temp here for the Las Vegas Legion. That's going to do it for us here on the main stage. Desk, close us out, guys.